Hello everyone, so I am back with another video and this video is a Zendaya inspired makeup tutorial. So Zendaya posted um, this photo here on Instagram and I fell in love with the makeup that she had on in this photo like instantly I fell in love. So I wanted to do a Zendaya inspired makeup tutorial based on that look for you guys. And yes, I love the way it turned out. I'm so satisfied with the way it turned out. And I think it kind of favors Zendaya. So without further ado, let's just get right into the video. All right, so I have already filled in my eyebrows and concealed around my eyebrows. So now I'm just going to apply my foundation now. And I am using, I'm feeling very lux luxurious today. So I'm going to use a high-end foundation. This is my Studio Fix foundation from MAC. I love this because it is full coverage. Full, full coverage. So now we're just going to apply that. And I'm also going to take this Clean Color White Lies Concealer Stick. This was only a dollar and I love this stuff. But I'm going to use this because it has like an orange base to it. I'm going to use this for the darkness around my mouth. I forgot to apply it so we're just going to apply it now. I'm also going to apply it underneath my eyes just where my eye bags are. So now I'm done with my foundation, so now I'm just going to go right into concealer. Today I'm going to be using my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. I told you I was feeling luxur luxurious. So I'm going to go in with my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in the shade NW20. Now a little bit of this goes a long way. I love this concealer because it's very creamy. Now this concealer, this particular shade in this concealer is very pink and pale compared to my skin tone but I like it that way because it has like a pink undertone so it can kind of get rid of the blueness that I have in my eye bags all right and we're just going to take my beauty blender and blend this out as well And since this concealer tends to have a pink undertone, I'm going to take my LA Girl Pro Concealer, and this is the yellow corrector. So I'm just going to take this and apply it over um, this this Pro Longwear, my Mac Pro Longwear. All right, I'm just going to blend this out with my Beauty Blender as well. All right, and I tend to crease really fast underneath my eyes, so I'm just going to go ahead and set that Ben Not Banana Powder. Set my concealer with my Ben Not Banana Powder. And to set this, I'm just going to use a cosmetic sponge.
now that I have highlighted, I'm just I'm going to go ahead and start on the eye makeup. Yay! Now to the fun part. So I'm going to apply my TG Cream Concealer in the shade Medium. This is what it looks like. I'm just going to apply this all over my lid just to work as a sh um, an eyeshadow base. Okay, and you've seen that I kind of brought went ahead and brought that concealer down my nose because I'm going to use that for my nose contour. But right now I'm just going to set that eyeshadow base with this shade from my Sephora, which is Come True Palette, the Creamy Cashmere shade. And I'm going to take my TG Dome Shadow Brush to set it. So, and don't mind me if you just see me looking at my phone. I'm just looking at the picture of Zendaya. Okay, so it looks like she goes really dramatic in her crease with like a cranberry brown color. So that's what we're going to start with. Alright, so I'm going to take my BH Cosmetics number 122 brush. And I'm going to be using for this look my Morphe 35C palette. I love this palette so much because it has such a variety of different colors. I'm going to take this color right here. I'm going to blend that all over my crease. Because it looks like in the picture that, that she has here that her crease is very dramatic. So that's what we're going to do. I'm going to go in with my BH Cosmetics 119 brush. I'm going to take this brown shade at the very end and I'm just, I'm going to smoke out my outer corner with this. And I'm also going to use this to blend into my crease just to give my crease a little bit of depth. Alright, and I'm just going to blend all this out. I'm going to go in with my Hard Candy Metallic Eyeshadow in the shade Golden Earth. Alright, and I'm just going to blend this out with my fingers. Okay, so I took my e.l.f. baked eyeshadow here, and this is in the color Enchanted. Um, I took a flat brush and I sprayed it, and I added just a little bit over the top of that Hard Candy Metallic eyeshadow. A 
Okay, so now that I have my eye makeup done, I'm just going to add a highlight to my inner corner and my brow bone. Okay, now that I am done applying my inner corner highlight and my brow bone highlight, I am just going to apply some lashes. So, I'm going to take the Kara Lashes in the number 48. Um, I've already taken one off, but you can just look at the bottom one there. So, that's what they look like. And I'm just going to apply these off camera really fast. Just because we don't want the band of the lashes to show, we're going to put eyeliner over it and then, you know, to blend our lashes with the fake lashes, we're going to apply mascara, so. That same crease color she has on her bottom lash line. So that's what we're going to do now. She just smoked it out. And I am going to use my e.l.f. eye crease brush just to smoke out that, smoke out my bottom lash line. Okay, so now we are done with the eye makeup and I'm just going to move on to contouring. So in the in the picture of Zendaya, it looks like she has a defined contour naturally. So I'm going to be using my NYX Professional um, Highlight and Contour Palette to contour. And I'm just going to be using this shade right here. And I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. tapered brush just to get that precision, that um, the definition of my contour right here in my cheekbones. And I'm going to go in with my BH Cosmetics brush number 114 just to buff that out. I'm just going to add just a little bit of product to the brush, not much. And I'm going to buff it out just a little bit. Not much because we still want it to be defined. So, now that I'm done contouring, I'm just going to go in with some of my Ben Not Banana Powder and I'm going to put some right underneath my contour to make it just a little bit more defined. So now that I've defined um, under my contour, I'm just going to contour my nose. And I'm going to contour my nose using that same contouring shade that I used to contour my cheekbones. And I'm going to go in with my BH Cosmetics brush number 118 to define, I mean to contour my nose.
Okay, so now I'm done contouring my nose. So now I'm going to go in with a little bit of blush. So, um, in the picture, she doesn't have too much, like, too dark of a blush. Like, it just, it's just like a natural, rosy cheek. So I'm going to go in with my Wet n Wild Pearlescent Pink blush. And I'm just going to apply just a little bit of this to my cheeks. And I'm just going to blend it all out using my small stipple brush from e.l.f. Alright, so I think we have baked enough, so I'm just going to wipe away this banana powder off my contour. So now we're going to move on to highlighting the face. So I'm going to go in with my Midnight Magnificence Highlighting Shade from my Wishes Come True palette. And I'm going to take my Eco Tools Highlighting Brush and I'm just going to spritz it with a little bit of the L'Oreal Infallible Setting Spray. Just to get the brush a little wet so it'll pick up more, pro more of the product. And I'm just going to add that to the hot points of my cheekbone. Okay, and I'm just going to go over that with some of my Physician's Formula Sexy Booster Highlight. And I'm also going to highlight my nose and all that. All that fun stuff. And I'm going to use a small brush to highlight my nose. Alright, so now that I'm done highlighting, now it's time to move on to lips. So today I'm going to be using um, a couple lip products from Clean Color. And I'm going to be using the Deep Red Lip Liner and the lipstick, the matte lipstick in the shade Antique Ruby. So this is what the lipstick look lo looks like. This is how dark it is. It's like a dark red. And then here is the eyeliner, I mean the lip liner here. And let me sharpen this really fast. Alright, so we're just going to line the lips with this deep red lip liner. Alright, so now that I'm done lining the lips, I'm just going to go over that lip liner with that Antique Ruby lipstick. Finally, I can move how I want it. I need pick the top and I'm zoning. You got me, I got you, and it's all that I need when I wake in the morning. For all the love. Alright, so 
so that does it for this Zendaya inspired makeup tutorial makeup look um, I love the way it turned out like I'm absolutely in love with the way it turned out like I didn't think it was going to turn out this well but I'm very satisfied with the results so if you do like this video don't forget to thumbs up the video down below and don't forget to subscribe until next time Got the